Hello YouTube folks, my name is Gary Shutt. So uh, I, w I just want to make a quick video because I've been meaning to do this for a while. My girlfriend uh, stumbled upon this song by Harry Styles. It's called Music for a Sushi Restaurant and she played it for me. And it's a, it's a catchy pop song, but I, I, my ear instantly picked up a thing that said, what's going on in that main chord progression there? <laughs> and when I started to process it, I, I, I realized what, what he was doing. It was a it was a take on a common uh, chord cliche, but it was parallel. I'll give you an example. Very, very common chord progression. This song is in F sharp, if you're in standard. F sharp major, and then you play the flat seven, E, and then you would do the first inversion four chord to the flat six. That's common. So the bass line would be F sharp, E, E flat, D. Common. But what my ear heard was is that it was going parallel. It wasn't doing the first inversion. It was actually playing an E flat major. So it goes like this. If, if you just play... Uh, the major bar chord all the way down, whole step, half step, half step. Uh, somebody share this and send this to Rick Beato because I, I want to hear his, his take on this too. So that's my quick thing on, on that song. So uh, not much there, just a quick analysis of a Harry Styles song. So it's either it's either somebody didn't know what they were doing and and they know this chord and just kind of moved it down not realizing that you're supposed to do this or they knew it there or somebody was really smart and said ah, I'm gonna mess with people's ears and play it like this because it works I mean it kind of works but the third chord definitely throws your ear off because you're not used to hearing that chord over that progression so anyway thanks for stopping by like uh, share and subscribe thanks bye